Hello and welcome back to my channel. Today we are going to declutter another messy spot in our house that is part of my Declutter Before 2020 projects, our laundry room. It is a disaster. Can I just say I'm thankful that I have a laundry room, but it is small and I can do much about the decoration because we are just renting here so i have to work with what i have and i hope i can show you a satisfying before and after of our laundry room so without any further ado let's get into it so this is what we are going to work on today. There are three baskets we use to sort our dirty laundry, this drying rack, a washing machine, a dryer that we use very seldomly another drying rack don't forget we are a family of uh, seven and some baskets on the floor mm -hmm. these drawers i have some more bits and pieces for my sewing projects that i have to go through as you can see the floor is pretty much stained it has holes but I can't do anything about it because as I told you we are just renting here and for the rest this is what we are going to declutter today let's get started <laughs> So this is everything I use for my laundry. First of all, washing soda. Unfortunately, I can't get it in another package than plastic. Baking soda and Savon de Marseille. It's a French soap, oil-based and handmade. I grate and then I put with either washing soda or baking soda into my laundry and that's pretty much I use. Now we are going to declutter these drawers and as always I'm going to do three piles, one for donation, one for tossing and one with all the things I'm going to keep.
So this is what I finally decluttered. This pile is going to be either recycled or is going to the trash. And this, all everything that's in this bin here is mostly sewing supplies and they will be donated. Are you ready for the outcoming? Just have a look at the before one more time. So here it is. Oh my gosh, this feels so good for my soul. No more clutter here. The drawers are decluttered. The rack is empty. No more clutter on the machines. This rack is empty too. It took me about two hours to do this and I can tell you it feels amazing. And I hope this can motivate you to fix your laundry room too. Thank you so much for watching. Hope you enjoyed it. If so, please give it a thumbs up, leave a comment down below and feel free to subscribe to my channel. See you next time. Bye.